Thank you. Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, Dr. William Samoy Ruto, the Deputy President, Regade Gachagua, the widow of uh, Kelvin Kiptum, Asanath and your two children, Caleb and Precious, the parents, the sporting fraternity, World Athletics, and the Kenyan Athletics leadership, friends, brothers, and sisters, and the clergy. Mine shall be very brief. First is to take this opportunity at a personal level to convey our deepest condolences to the family of Kelvin Kiptum, a flame that has been blown out by an unfortunate accident only a few days ago. Your Excellency, it's a difficult moment, particularly for the family and for the people of this area and Kenyans and the athletics community. We can only wish and pray that the record that Kiptum was planning to break shall one day be broken by Precious and Caleb. The other thing I would just want to highlight, Your Excellency, is that we wish to recognize and appreciate your government because you have provided a strong, peaceful, and stable, and secure environment for these young people to be able to showcase their talent and be able to globally scale this particular terrain without any worries whatsoever. It is important that we continue to rally behind you as a nation so that peace and security and stability will anchor the opportunities that abound amongst our people. Finally, Your Excellency, I have come to this place where they say it's high altitude. And high altitude comes with a strong wind and a chill. So I have learned that in order to beat the wind, the secret amongst the high altitude people is that you have to keep running <laughs> so that you can be warm. And in the process, you can deal with this very strong wind. And uh, so that we don't take any more time, because Nilpuangalia, I realize that the time the politicians have taken to speak, if Kelvin was running, he would have actually broken the record <laughs> of the two hours. So in short, we politicians have taken more than two hours to talk, and that is what Kelvin wanted to, to shatter. So with those few words, let me now call my brother, Rigade Gachagua, so that he can come forward, make a few remarks, and invite His Excellency the President, and may Kiptum's soul rest in eternal peace. Thank you.